Hello! Well, you know what they say, April showers bring May flowers, and boy, do we have some May flowers here for you. This is such an exciting time for us at the shop. I know I say that a lot, but we have a lot of exciting things happening. And the biggest thing we have right now, which is happening today, is the launch of our May Flowers Dream Closet Box. We're gonna get right into it and show you the pro photos that have been done by our wonderful Ernesto of Doll Dumb Photography and show you our beautiful outfit that has been designed by Diana Vining for Virtual Doll Convention. This outfit has been in the works since 2021 and it is now here and ready. So introducing Flower Festival. Designed by the multi-talented Diana Vining, May 2023's Grace Boutique offering is a celebration of everything spring. Grace's vibrantly printed dress, created to evoke the voluptuousness of petals, features a mini dress with a coquettish overskirt while gathered flounces hem the sweetheart neckline. If collectors of VDC's Grace Marie Fitzpatrick ever wanted a dress to spell springtime, this one is it. And the fit is utter perfection with a metal snap closure in the back and a halter top. The dress is absolutely wonderful, but the photos are divine. Ernesto worked so hard on this magical forest scene and Grace is like trudging through the forest in this gorgeous, gorgeous outfit with her purse of flowers. I love it. Ernesto, you absolutely slayed. So let's read about the purse that comes inside your box. So inside your box, you get the fashion and the purse. Okay. It is called a tisket, a tasket, a yellow handled basket. VDC's May 2023 offering is perfectly accessorized with a straw purse that reminds us that summer is not far away. This perfectly practical purse for gathering blooms secures in the front with a leatherette and golden medallion closure. Designed for VDC by Diana Vining. So here is the purse. We have not had a straw purse like this ever in VDC's history. It is so nice. It is made by Ruby Red Galleria and it comes with a little bundle of flowers that you can put into it. So the outfit is absolutely amazing as all of our outfits are that are for our dream closet boxes. This one is particularly so beautiful. It is fully lined. It has multi-functions and you can style it different ways. We have our creative director here, Mr. Christopher Johnson. He's over there and he's, oh, he's got a basket full of flowers. Christopher, come on in because he has been working all morning literally hours, it looks so effortless, it takes hours to create, show him, show him what he's doing, <laughs> to create these looks. It is so beautiful. So Hello. Christopher, hi, welcome, welcome. I come to, bearing flowers. Welcome to our unboxing. You know, there's people out there that want to do a, that, that first of all, they want a Christopher paper doll. <laughs> Uh, yes. Uh, well, I guess we can give the people what they want. <laughs> what would your paper doll come with? What What are the three accessories your, your paper doll would come with? Uh, that's a really good question. Um, <laughs> coffee. I would come with a cup of coffee, a tube of lipstick, and like a pair of glasses. Yeah, yeah for sure. That's what it would be. I love it. Yeah. So you worked hard styling our outfit. Now, what do you, this, this grace right here, this is the basic outfit that this it the comes basic with. Outfit. Yes. What do you think? So I love this. I love that it's really versatile. Um, it fits her very well. It actually fits Grace and Elwyn both very nicely. Um, but it's a really sort of casual cotton fabric, so it doesn't feel overstated. But it certainly is dressy enough if you want something glamorous. Um, it's light, it's springy, it's fresh, it's refreshing. I think it's just a really, um, very pretty frock. And you can sort of, um, finagle, uh, finagle it a couple different ways. Yes, it is. It is very refreshing. I love that word for it. And the flower that comes on the, that is on Grace's head right now, uh -huh. and you put them all around, yeah. every single box comes with one of these flowers. Yes. What do you think? So these are really nice. They're really sort of, um, they're fluffy and pretty and uh, they're simple, right? Like you can sort of dress up 
something like on Grace, it's a it's functionally a hat for Grace, right? But they're also they're clips on the back, so you're not um, confined to wearing it any just one way. Um, you can wear this, of course, as a clip for yourself. This could be like a little. Uh, brooch, if you will, right? There's a couple different ways to throw these on. Um, they also work really nicely as a sort of gathering pin for yes! a couple. Yes! Oh, right? I, di I didn't want to shock everyone, but let's let's just <laughs> let's just dive right into the mix and match looks yeah. that you have created. So this is so cute. Yeah, I really like this. I I think cotton doesn't instinctively feel really like high fashion, really glamorous, but there's certainly a way to make it that. So we just took the peplum that gathers around the waist to the back and then secured that with one of those flower pins. Um, and it has a really nice accent with the uh, peach necklace that we have here. Little, uh, very nice sort of scale with that little gem there. Um, lots of gold accents in the hair and the necklace in the uh, purse that some of you are getting in your boxes um, that you have been probably seeing for the last couple months. Gifts with purchase. And then we've got a kind of a classic old gold grace shoe we've had for a little while. Um, so again, if you have pieces in your collection, you've been a collector of grace for a while, then you have a lot of these to reach for. Look how cute. Yeah. Every single one of your boxes comes with this flower. We have all different colors, but they all coordinate with the fashion. Yeah, so really nicely. Really good. Uh, we've got a sort of like librarian take on the dress, which I love a little bit more casual, a little bit more understated sort of, uh, you know, on her way to the market, um, paired with a pair of glasses, and uh, we reversed the white belt to make it a little bit more casual, again, to sort of complement those <clears throat> complement those nude shoes. Um, and she threw in a little cardigan because it's a little chilly outside. It's so cute. Um, These cardigans are on their way to Ernesto for photos, but we're just going to take a photo here and put it in the boutique so you can yeah. snag one if you want one. It's a really lovely sort of baby pink, but it's not a cool tone color. It's almost peachy. It's really very, very pretty. Um, and I think it matches the dress so nicely. So nicely. Yeah. And we have mules, which we'll talk about a little bit later when we... Sh oh, well, let's talk about them now when we show the, the other girls over here. So... We have M Facets Boutique, Marsha Friend at Facets Boutique created the cute little peach necklaces that we have as an add-on and she also created these wonderful mules that we have in four different colors. Yeah. What do you think about the mules? Well, first of all, they fit Grace and Ella and Anne Nima. So if you need a versatile shoe, they are wonderful. Um, the arch of their feet is the real sort of difference between the dolls. They're different sizes, but they're also a different arch. And uh, this fits both of them really comfortably. Um, I think they're chic. I don't think they're overstated. If you want something that is fashionable, they certainly are. But they're not, you know, high glamour. Um, so they pair with something like cotton really nicely while still elevating it a little bit. Oh yeah. Um, I love the, I love PVC. I love vinyl. I like that it's like a fashion texture. And so I think that is a really fun way to make something more, more classic like this slightly edgier. Um, it comes in a clear with a nude base, sort of a turquoise with a deeper turquoise, um, sole. Same with red and then a pink color, like a like a pink color. Yeah, but they look so good. And you've been using them on styles for, gosh, the past six months. Oh, yeah. I mean, and we've well, been wanting to put these out. That's the real thing about them. It's like, I like them with this, but I love throwing them in with lots of other things. You saw these for uh, the white dress that we did in February. Um, mm -hmm. You saw these with so many things. I mean, we've used them for a couple months. So if you've been watching the videos and wondering what that shoe is, when that shoe's coming, yes. um, be time. surprise and delight. Yes, <laughs> yes, this is this is the time for the shoe. I love it. Um, so they are here and they're coming out with this and I, I think it's a, a really lovely color scheme. The dress has so many colors to play with. Um, as we were getting ready to shoot this today, I was thinking of all the things that you could wear with this um, that we've put out in the past. So uh, again, if you have boxes and boxes sitting around of uh, grace memorabilia, put them to use. This is a yeah. great dress to pair with um, almost any color. Let's see what you did here. You did the sea sucker dress that yeah. we've had out for, gosh, almost a couple years now. How did you do that? So, uh, it, it's, uh, again, I think I've said before, it's all sort of uh, like dental floss and chewing gum. It's just <laughs> sort of, it's not for practicality. You're not wearing it out in the world, but it certainly is cute to have fun with. So, this is a full dress that we sort of tucked underneath itself. So, you've oh, got okay. the... Um, Oh, you tucked top it down. There, right? And then that's sitting over the skirt of the uh, of the dress for this box. So you can sort of do if you have other dresses, this is just an elastic waist, right? Like this is 
it's fairly easy to uh, mm -hmm. to sort of finagle. So I just I sort of disguised a little belt, sort of loosely sitting over the top of that. Um, but playing with that sort of nice bright red um, in the shoe and with the belt, uh, this this silhouette of the top is such a great piece to wear as a shirt. Um, and so I figure there's you know certainly ways to play with that that way. Um, I'm still figuring out how to just wear it as a skirt because the the layers of this are you know you've got a long layer and a short layer and whatever. But I'm gonna see if I can finagle another way to wear this as just the the bottom and then maybe like a sweater on top. Oh yeah, that's yeah. a fun idea. Yeah. So many of our members when they receive their fashions, they post their styling ideas. And yeah. It's so inspiring. Well, I would hope so. I don't. I, I want to. You know, we learn just as much from you as you do from us. Yes, so, we do. Um, thank you for sharing all of your photos and and for playing with this uh, in such a sort of playful spirit. Yes. Um, it should be fun. It should be silly and uh, and lean into it. I mean, she's. Why can't you wear a gingham with like a floral print? You know. I don't know. I, I always feel like with fashion, I love fashion, but I I wouldn't do this. And then sure. when, when you help us take the leap, it really helps. Well, uh, I figure if you can't be a lunatic with your own fashion, you can certainly be a lunatic with doll fashion. Yes. Right? Um, you lean into it somewhere. And like maybe you would never wear a, a, a blocked strawberry on your head, but who's stopping you? Baby? <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Well, Christopher Johnson, thank you so much. You do so much for us. You're so inspiring, and this was so helpful. Thank I love you. it. Yes, thank you. Yes, happy to help. Yeah, he also styled this beautiful set, too, so it looks gorgeous. It's always so much fun learning fashion and learning ways to style and uh, do our clothes with a Christopher Johnson, so that was fun. Now, if you're new to us or you're watching this and you're like, what is happening? Our, our subscription, a Dreambox subscription, it's a program that we do, first of its kind, only one of its kind, that comes every single month where you receive a fashion, a story, an accessory that goes with the fashion. Every box is different, every theme is different, and it's a total blast. Our subscription is was supposed to start next month, but I haven't heard from the factory anything too promising for it to be able to start next month, but for sure, we're going to start in July. Now, when I know these dates for sure, believe me, I'm going to put it out there and give you solid dates, but manufacturing, it's a big process. Like I said, we've had this in the works since 2021. So we do have to be patient, but my goodness, by the time we get the clothes, it is so worth it. Now we are working on another box that is like this one where you can just purchase it. So this is not a subscription box where you have to be in the subscription that's automatically billed. You can buy it. So if you've never been a part of our subscription and you want to see what it's like, this is a perfect opportunity. Next, So for next month, if we don't start the subscription for, for real, we're gonna do a box called Backyard Fun, which is so cute, and it comes with the most gorgeous rain boots that I have ever seen in my life manufactured for a doll. It is amazing. But anyway, if you have any questions, just put them in the comments or shoot us an email, and we're always happy to help. So this box right here is just like our other boxes in the way of the components. So every box you receive your fashion, which is packaged just like this and then our creative director of the Dream Closet Box and Virtual Doll Convention, Diana Vining, created the wonderful May Flowers Paper Doll, which has our beautiful Grace and her dress and the purse and some flowers, and there's even a hat cut out. I absolutely love that. And one of the most beautiful parts of our boxes is the note and the story that you receive in your boxes. They always make you feel good. Every time that you read one, you will take a breath of fresh air and just feel so much better about life and the world and yourself. I just cannot tell you how good Diana Vining is at writing these stories. She is amazing. Diana, I know you're watching this right now, girl. You do such an incredible job. I'm just gonna read the last few lines. So in the story, Grace goes to a flower festival and she brings you along with her as her special date to the flower festival. And she talks all about it and what she did and, and her day of sunshine with you. And she talks about at the very end, she says, and as I look around at all of the beautiful floral displays, I'll no doubt be thinking that if friends were flowers, I would definitely pick you. Keep on blooming, XOXO Grace. So sweet. So these are something that you can keep 
as a keepsake of all of your adventures. So if you've been with us for the last two years, we're going into year three of these amazing stories and paper dolls. So the paper doll is in a new position this year and it's just amazing. So along with your paper doll, you in every single box, there is always a fun craft or two. This craft is really cute. So we got fairy fun crafts. There is a garden book of memories. So you can add some blank pages to this book and make your own mini album, your own mini little album of maybe your day at the flower festival or some miniature pressed flowers to make it really cute. So sweet. And then these are just some little whimsical figures that you can uh, cut out and put in your doll garden. So we have a little mushroom house and a dolly dingle flower fairy and a little tiptoe through the tulips uh, cut out that is so cute. So that comes in your box and it is so fun. And then we have a little postcard from Grace that just says, if friends were flowers, I'd pick you. And she's walking through the flower festival looking so gorge. Now, one of the ones that I'm excited about is we have a little packet of seeds, a little packet of flower seeds. Every little packet is different. We have all different varieties. And if you can't plant them, then I don't know, give them to somebody else. We have a pair of flower themed socks. We have about four or five different styles of cute little flower themed socks. We have done socks in a lot of our boxes. So at this point, if you are have been with us for a while, you probably have quite a fun collection of different socks. So those come in your box. We have a variety of stickers. So we have butterflies and little flowers and gray stickers right here. So these you can use for scrapbooking or putting on a box to send to a friend or any place that you want to use a sticker. This is what your purse looks like when it's in your box. These little lollipops come in all different colors and we had them custom made by a cute little family run business. They made them fresh for us. We have them in all different colors. I have not tried one yet, but they are super, super cute. So that is your little snack. In your box, you receive a fun little snack that coordinates with the theme and I thought these were just adorable. So you receive one of those. You receive your flower, which can be on Grace's head. You can use it on yourself. You can use it all different ways. So that's your little brooch. And then there's a maypole little, little flower set, which I think could be fun for you. So you could use this a lot of different ways. It's probably really crinkly in the video. You can take your flowers off and use them for something for Grace or Let's see, how am I looking? Let's put it up like that. Or you can give it away or you can put it on yourself. I think this is pretty cute. I, don't I look like I'm ready to dance around a maypole? The boxes, part of the thing that takes so much time with our boxes is we do custom boxes. The production on our boxes takes over a month. So there is a lot of planning that goes into by the time that you actually see these boxes. But inside the boxes, here you can sort of see the sprinkle. We have lots of sprinkle that is flower themed. The sprinkle we order months in advance so we can get our themed sprinkle. At the bottom of the box we have, it's kind of hard to see, but it is a heart shape of flowers and then Grace is holding the flowers. And then we got green sprinkle to simulate grass. So it is just a lot of fun, a big breath of fresh air. This fashion in itself is just so perfect for springtime. Every single purse comes with a different kind of bushel of flowers, so yours is gonna be unique to yourself. Again, the shoes are so much fun. They are $20 and they have been made with Marsha, our wonderful Marsha from Facets Boutique, and we have them in all different colors. And Grace and Elowen wear them perfectly, and the fashion, Grace and Elowen and Nima can wear perfectly too. So one question that I want to bring up, I'm so glad I didn't forget, which I, ha I wouldn't forget. We have something really exciting coming with Tamara Casey, our wonderful pattern designer with Designs by Jude. You're gonna be seeing a lot of Tamara Casey in the next couple weeks. It is such a fun and exciting thing. I'm not gonna tell you exactly what it is because it's gonna be a surprise. But when we start our official subscription, we have 225 spots, by the way, which we are so excited about, and you will receive a wonderful digital download pattern sponsored by Tamara Casey of Designs by Jude every month. We don't have one for this month, but 
when we start, which she's already working hard on the pattern, you're gonna receive your pattern at a value of $12.95, included in your subscription. We will have a fully digital subscription if you want to be a subscriber and just sew, and that's always super fun too. So we, we're gonna have both of those programs back. So don't worry, uh, you're gonna have the full experience, and we are so grateful to have our wonderful Tamara Casey of Designs by Jude. This whole thing is a giant collaboration from our manufacturers, the people who do our boxes, our printing, the everything that we do, Ernesto with our photos, Diana Vining with so much creativity, Christopher setting it all up like this. I used to set up our sets and so now I'm really glad that I don't have to. Not only is he better at it than I am, I just love having somebody else's ideas. It's all about ideas and sharing. And when you join the group, you are part of a club. And every month, the members are posting their outfits and posting their ideas and posting their thoughts. And it is so much fun. We also post a lot on uh, on social media, just on YouTube and, and these items, when they come into your dream closet, they are in your dream closet. A lot of people have like wondered, oh, do I need all, all those clothes? Yes, you do. You need all of these clothes because they mix and match and they are a amazing way to look back at your life at the last 12 months of the year and remember all the experiences and all the fun you had and what it felt like that time when you opened that February box and what it felt like when you opened the December box. And it brings back such good memories. So these clothes, it's amazing how many you can fit into a very small box. So don't worry about having too much. It's okay. It's a good problem to have good problem to have. So I'm just really, I, I think this is beautiful and I hope that you enjoy this. This is a Diana Binding original. It is so well done. One thing I wanted to show you right before uh, we finish here is that the dress itself, it has snaps in the back and it is fully lined. It's kind of hard to tell, but it is fully lined. Just beautifully done. Okay, so the, the peplum overlay is not lined, but the whole skirt and everything is just fully lined and then it ties in the back, which you can do cute things with that bow. So it is wonderful and it fits all kinds of fashion dolls. Like this, some of our outfits are really, really customized. Our factories have both of our dolls at the factory. They have both bodies and they make the dolls custom, but a lot of times I do ask them to be aware of fabrics and different things we can use to really make it so not only Grace, Nima, and Elowen can wear them, but all kinds of other fashion dolls. So this one works for a lot of fashion dolls because it is a halter top and you can, you can tie it and kind of adjust it. So that's one thing I really love about it. Speaking of fashion, Stanley, let's back up a little bit so we can show everyone my flower festival dress. I have been saving it for this occasion because it is totally covered in flowers and I think it is so much fun. Flowers are just, it's a new beginning. It's, it's a rebirth. It's, it's, they're little blooms of hope. Flowers are just such a beautiful thing to witness and to plant and to have and to wear on clothes and they just make you happy. And this one has pockets, so girl. You can't go wrong with that, am I right? So I am, I am excited. Thank you so much for all of your patience, for everything that we have been working on and planning towards. Again, every step of the way, I will let you know what's going on. I really, really, really appreciate it. Believe me, once we get our first load of clothes, it's gonna have like six or eight months worth and it's gonna be so worth it, so fun just wild, just so good. I'm, I'm really excited. So that's all we have for today. I hope you enjoy. Let me see some of your posts and your style when you get your box. I'd love to get some feedback and let you, let me know, let me know what you think. So thank you so much for tuning into Mayflowers. Thank you to everybody who's involved. So many people, I really appreciate you. We got such a great team here. Thank you, Stanley, for filming. Thank you to our editor, Larissa, and we'll see you all very soon. Bye.